Hi, Scott from Digital Fish with content that catches. Matthew Hewitson from Fishing in God's Own and I were on a Northland trip with lures and bait to see what we could catch. The first drifts were with big soft baits before we moved closer in to try casting in the wash along the rocky coastline. This can be a great way to fish, sneaking in along the deeper drop offs searching for a lurking snapper. We got some hits before finally nailing the first eating fish. We moved further out for a deeper drift and I had a big gulp 7 inch grub on a 3 ounce sinker. Although the fish was the right colour, it wasn't the right species. These guys taste alright, with firm white chunky flesh. It was Matt's turn next with some kind of reef fish on his soft bait. A rather aggressive leather jacket had hooked itself. These guys love to nip soft baits to pieces and can cost the soft bait fishermen a lot of money. There was some good sign on the sounder so we stopped for a look. My choice was a Hayabusa Jack Eye from Go Fish. These lures have a good hang time in the water column and action. We drifted and caught a few species on the jigs. Changing tactics we anchored up over a drop off and tried the old bait and burly. Snapper came out to play and it was the kind of habitat big Mujia snapper liked to lurk around. I thought a large kahawai head would do the trick and tempt any big fellas to have a bite, but I was wrong. The smaller fish took the kahawai head off the hook and got hooked himself instead. Back out to deeper water and we managed to put a few more fish in the bag like this golden snapper. On the way home we saw a fin on the surface and went in for a closer look. A huge sunfish was cruising along. These guys can get really big, but aren't really a fish for catching. Our time was up. A mixed bag, but always a great day in the water. This is Scott from Digital Fish with content that catches.